Hello there. My name is Jocelyn, you may call me Joy, and today I am going to just be updating you uh, a little bit about what's going to happen in the future. So, um, I've had my hand lasered in the past, when was it, three days ago? Uh, that's still a thing, as you can see, it's, well, I'm just putting on some aloe vera now. Uh, it's looking very sore, it's, it's painful, uh, put it that way. It's a process, it's not going to be quick. Um, it was in fact the fifth session that I had, and yeah, that's still ongoing. Like I said, it's a process, it's gonna take some time. But if you see my hand, like, you know, when I'm gesturing wildly like I do, yeah, that's why it looks so red and inflamed and everything. It's not, you know, an infection. It's what's supposed to happen when you have a laser remove your tattoos. So uh, I advise you to never do this <laughs> unless it's really, really necessary. The other thing I want to quickly mention here is that this video and future subsequent videos is brought to you with the help of this the Go Viral For You Vlogging Kit, which, hashtag not sponsored, uh, it was in fact a gift from a very close personal friend who is probably watching right now, so thank you very much. Uh, I want to say that in, in, you know, publicly. And it's great. It's got a thing for the camera, it's got a thing for the light. The light actually has three different colours on it. I'm using white right now. We've got cool blue and warm, like, orangey yellow as well. But those, I think, are used more for just sort of balancing out what light you have. So it's not really for, like, special effects, although I could probably use that with special effects and filters and all the other stuff that I tend to use sometimes. The box was a bit broken, but everything else is absolutely fine. So he got a really good deal on it. And if if you are watching this, John, and you lied to me about how much you actually paid up for this, I will not be happy. <laughs> the uh, the weird thing about this, though, which I, I have sort of seen, is that uh, the the like pictures of people using this. Is a bit biased towards a certain slant of you know people. Um, we've got makeup here, we've got more makeup here, we've got uh, more makeup up here, and then we've got this person doing some cooking, but the phone is actually pointing at the boobs. <sighs> people cannot advertise their shit properly. <laughs> ah, Stick teeth, right. So, the other sort of updating news stuff that I actually want to talk about is channel stuff. So, I'm going to be starting two new series on this channel to try and boost ratings. One of those things is going to be really fun, fairly easy, um, but I know I, <sighs> I'm falling into an already saturated market here. But I gotta try things somehow, some way, so I will be looking at various memes, reacting to memes, reacting to um like that kind of thing. And yeah, I know a lot of other people already do that, but I tend to enjoy watching those videos, so why not? The other thing is slightly more well, it's very much more serious. I'm going to be doing a series all about freedom of speech because this topic doesn't go away. It's always going to be prominent in our society and in our conversations that we have, especially online. Freedom of speech is, is so integral to what we do and, and how we live our lives, even offline. And I just have a lot to say about it. And this is going to be slightly more, um, well, you know, it's going to be more research. It's going to be more facts-based rather than opinion-based. 
But my usual content is not going anywhere. I'm still going to be doing all of my usual opinion stuff and talking about trans stuff and LGBT plus topics and all of the other weird stuff that I like to talk about and throwing in some fun gaming stuff every now and again just because I want to. That's all staying, so if that's what you're here for, great. Anyway, that's it for this update for now. I'm going to make another video now, <laughs> so I'll see you in a bit. Bye! <laughs>